This railway viaduct, built in 1850, has two of its piers resting in the River Calder at Worley in Lancashire. They were beginning to be undermined by the fast flowing water. As a temporary measure, in October 2011, stones were placed around one of the piers. An inflatable barrier was used to keep the current away from the work area. After the stones had been placed, the barrier was removed to be used again. In the spring of 2013, the river was once again diverted around each pier. The Environment Agency removed as many fish as possible before they started work. This time the riverbed was excavated to a depth of 2.5 metres. These rocks are to be the new foundation of the riverbed. The original silt and mud was returned to help the river recover from the disturbance. Sensors have been fixed at various points along the viaduct to measure any movement in the structure. It was decided that two of the piers and the arch between them were unstable. The arch was reinforced with a layer of concrete. Piles are driven down on each side of both piers. These piles support each end of the girders that were put through the brickwork. Finally, the foot of each pier was encased in concrete. All of this work was carried out with no interruption to the rail traffic above. 163 years old and still going strong.